excited, really totally excited to be here and to stand here in front of all of you guys. I feel really connected with all of you because we are connected. You are studying in a place where I was studying. And I want something like, a, I have a, something like a wish, or not something like that, just a wish, to share something with you guys. To share and maybe to make an impact, a small impact for your souls, for your brains. And another one moment is one important, but sorry for my English. I get just two persons from my English exam. Sorry, really sorry. <laughs> <coughs> and with that connection, it was something I love, I really thought in love one man's just words, something like, imagine just for night and uh, in the sky, is, the sky is full of the stars, the August sky, and you are watching to the sky, you are watching to the sky and you see something like a lot of stars, a lot of suns, planets or something like that. And he said, like many people, many people when we are realizing the dimensions, when we are realizing the sizes, how we are small in all the universe, how much we are small and you are so small, you like a dust, you are like nothing, like you don't have any meaning in all of this universe, in everything. And when you are realizing it, you feel like that. <coughs> and this man said, when he looks up to the sky, to the stars, he feels so big. Because he understands and he feels and he's, he sees with all the things and he has another interpretation that all of these stars is a part of himself. Is a part of himself and it's something like, how do you say, it's, it's amazing. <laughs> oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Okay. And, uh, when he is realizing it and this another way of interpretation for him, it's something like a huge inspiration. The understanding that somehow it's happened that every one of us, somehow we are alive. We have a life. Everyone who is sitting, you or you or you or somewhere you, everyone is alive. But why? Why you are living here? Why you are sitting here? Why you are listening to this pastor? <laughs> I don't know. Why? Do you have a purpose? For what are you living? Why you are studying? Why you have to go to university after that? Why you have to, I don't know, to have a work or have two kids or have to, I don't know, to lie in the Cape Coast class. <laughs> <laughs> in the coffin and, I don't know, sing a song about Crimea River, I don't know. <laughs> Who knows? Who knows? And every one of us should have this, something like the questions, the scientists, I think, should have these questions like, why, how to, what we are asking for, from what it is made or something like that. And you should ask these questions for yourself sometimes in your life. What is your purpose? Why you are here? You should ask sometimes, several times, I don't know, like today or something like that. Where you should to go? Where you should to go? And uh, sometimes it happens when you are choosing one way. You are going on this way, you are going and everything is destroyed. Everything is destroyed. Like for example, it was several times like uh, my girlfriend left me out, so Carlos, she said just go out Carolis. <laughs> After several weeks, several weeks we said like Carolis from one job we quitted me, we said Carolis go out, you are a terrible worker. <laughs> we said one in one place and another place and you are something like a crying a river, a really big river, like a lot, big, 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 huge. <laughs> and what to do in this position when you are in the biggest, 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 that's for there, and in the biggest problem in your life, how to survive, how to live, what to do. There is one thing which is helping for me a lot of, to just to go out, <coughs> just go out from your place and try something, something that is really, but you really don't like you maybe, maybe just to try something new. Just go out, don't not step. Just if you someone put it on your face or I know on the ground, you should just to stand up and just go somewhere to try something. Like after that, when I said my girlfriend left me, the job quitted me and after that, 
I just spend it in one place, in one bar. Sorry, I drink some beers and after that was on go and blah blah blah. But in the next morning, it was something like I went in some somehow in one place and then I, I get in that place. I just no in that organization just one person. I just went to this place and I became this organization president. So just imagine one day you are something like in the biggest deep 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 hole. And another day, you uh, something became a president of organization, a huge organization, and it's something like just to try, just to go somewhere, not to sit somewhere in your bed. And I don't know, really. I'm so excited, and I'm too much excited, and it's difficult for me to talk. And I would like to just to say, like everyone, for all of you guys, or of all of you guys, the first, just try to take everything what the life gives. And to try everything, just if it's from another planet or from another places, or it's totally that you don't like it or something like that, just from yourself, just open your minds with burning hearts, with sparkling eyes, jump in, in jump in, and with 100 percent just to feel it, and let's see what the life will give for you, to be or not to be. Thank you.